Hello everybody and welcome back to Multiplays Legend of Zelda the Minish Cap. Uh, off screen I went and shrunk myself down to Minish size so that in this part we could go ahead and enter the bookshelf to get to Elder Library. <clears throat> and as you can see there are now books in places that were empty before. Though seriously, why the hell did they accept Books without fines. The grooves! The grooves! <sighs> and now we go into this one, too, and here's Elder Library. First, we do a Kingstone fusion with him before uh, getting down to business. And uh, something interesting. This unlocks a special type of enemy that you can only encounter through certain keenstone fusions, which I cannot specify right now. Basically, they're golden, and they take a lot more damage than usual. And if you beat them up, they drop big rupees. So keep them in mind if you're ever short on cash. But what is it? What do you need? Hmm? You want to visit the Temple of Droplets? Very well. You are the first such brave person in a long while. Stand on the clover in front of me. Alright, alright. You kids today. You have no patience for an old man. Well, go stand over there, just like I told you. Whoa! Now open! Secret mystery panel! Huh? Ah! Whoa! -ho -ho! Wasn't that fantastic? Now then, it's up to you to pass this trial safely and recover the tool you need. Oh, what fun! I do so love the real nitty gritty of adventuring. Ugh! Oh, I just smacked my hip on something. Well, not my hip, my... whatever it is I have now. My brim? Whatever. That old fool must just love sending people down on dangerous missions. And how did that library get into the Temple of Droplets anyway? I guess the answer lies up ahead. Keep moving, boy. Alright, and uh... Basically... Once you get rid of enough of these guys, they got the gust jar to take advantage of that mushroom. And uh, something really interesting that happened yesterday in the world of Nintendo. Basically, with the launch of New Super Mario Bros. 2, they are doing simultaneous digital and hard copy releases of any first party games to be launched for the 3DS. And that is just really, really awesome to me. Now, but um, right now I am currently undecided as to whether or not I would personally take advantage of the download part because um, I did download uh, the Four Sword Anniversary Edition and um, I got it on the DSi because at that point I did not have a 3DS yet and I tried to transfer it to my 3DS but something happened, and the 3DS couldn't receive it properly, and I didn't know what to do, so I turned my DSi off, and when I turned my DSi back on, no more Four Sword. So I was like, aw, sad face. So... If anything about the digital release, I am iffy about um, losing my game. For such a similar reason, but I do like how Nintendo's making that sort of shift in their games. 
it's pretty neat. <laughs> and uh, here I try to go after that heart piece we saw when we were getting the um, power bracelets. But as you will be able to see as I progress to that heart piece, it's kind of unreachable at this point because um, you have to get into shallow water before you can um, step onto direct land in this game. And there is no shallow water or another room that we could enter into to get to it. And there the cat is playing tennis with me. <laughs> So I'm like, crap. But uh, do keep it in mind for later. As well as that frozen chest we saw when I first left the um, flipper dungeon. And, uh, something to talk about. Hmm. Um. Crap. 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 I, I don't. I don't know what to talk about. Um. 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 Oh, thank goodness! I'm using the ocarina. Yay! We can go to the lake now. <laughs> Alrighty, and you and jump down, and now that we have the flippers, we can get a couple of special things around here. Go here, dive, and you get a piece of art. And now we have ten heart containers. Yay! And now we're swimming, and we're swimming, and we're swimming. And over here, another heart piece. Yay! And now we swim, and we swim, we swim, swim, we swim, we swim. And this is the Temple of Droplets. The entrance itself is a Minish Portal. Isn't that pretty neat? Chatter, chatter. I'm freezing in here. If you don't find that element quickly, I'm going to turn into a hatsicle. Hurry up, Mooty! And as you can see, the floor is ice and traction has gone out the window. So do try to be careful when you navigate here, because otherwise you might fall down the hole. Shield might be better here, Muti. Come on. Yeah. And only the ones on the towards the inside of the room will fly out and attack you. And since this is the only unlocked door, we go this way. <laughs> and just to make things easier, we are taking care of those things first. And we see a switch, so let's switch it. It's a lever that we must pull. Well, technically push. And then we go up and fall down the hole. And you see that block of ice there? Three guesses what we did with it. Push. Push, melt. And now we have a kiwi! Yay! 
push that block to get out of here and we go back up to progress to the locked door after dealing with these pots <laughs> and take care of these enemies Now, a note, if you make an enemy drop down a floor, it will respawn when you come down the room instead of being completely killed. And how I'm doing this puzzle right now is the correct one, but um, I get the impression that I'm doing it wrong, so I go back up to reset the puzzle. And then I remember, oh right, I, do, I did this right on the first time. <laughs> so, time wasting! So, go back up. Fall down the hole. And do this puzzle all over again. Push! And... Push! And push. And right there is where I remember. Oh, I did it right the first time. Push. 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 And now we are pretty much done with the pushing, if you can line yourself up with a block of ice correctly. Come on. And... Yay! Boss key! But... so soon? Man, this temple must be short. Flip that switch to close the panel, because we're gonna need to walk over it. And then... we make our way over here. And then over here, and here is the boss door. So that will be it for this part. Next time we shall tackle the boss of this dungeon, and we will have lots of funny fun fun times. See you then!